Okay, in this video, we are going to write fractions as percents. Now, the first question says, write 3 50ths as a percent. In order to write fractions as percents, we have to write an equivalent fraction with 100 in its denominator because we know that percents are always out of 100. So, in this first one, we're going to take 3 50ths as equal equivalent to something over 100 because we know that percents are about 100. Then we ask ourselves, well, what can we do to 3 50ths to get an equivalent fraction out of 100? Well, we can multiply. We notice we can multiply it by 2. So we're going to multiply the denominator by 2. And whatever we do to the denominator, we're going to do that to the numerator. And so 3 times 2 is 6. Now, it's 6 over 100. Now, that is in equivalent to 6%. Because percents are out of 100. So, we can state that 3 50ths, which is our original fraction, is equivalent to 6%. Now, question number 2 gives us 9 1,000. So we have to find a, a fraction that's equivalent to 9 1,000s that has a denominator that is 100 because 100, there is a, it is 100%. So 9 over 1,000 equals something over 100. Now, we have to ask ourselves, how do we go from 1,000 down to 100? Well, we have to divide by a power of 10, or divide by 10. Because 1,000 divided by 10 equals 100. So whatever we do to the denominator, we have to do to the numerator. So 9 divided by 10 equals 0 and 9 tenths. Now, a lot of students and people have a hard time understanding that a percent can be a decimal. So yes, this is 9 tenths over 100. Well, it's now in percent form, so it's 9 tenths percent. That is actually less than 1%. So we can conclude that 9 over 1,000 which is our original fraction, is equivalent to 9 tenths percent. Thank you for taking time to watch this video on converting fractions to percents.